Hello and welcome to this tutorial about the Directional Blur tool. The Directional Blur, as you would expect from the name, allows you to add blurs into a specific direction on your image. The Length Control controls how long that blur is. The Angle Control controls the direction of the blur and Glow controls how much glow is added to the blurred areas. The blur options are linear blur as you see here, radial blur which gives you a slightly bulgy looking blur, where raising the angle actually adds some twist to the image. The centered blur is similar to the linear blur but does not only apply the blur in one direction but actually in two opposite directions. The zoom type produces a blur that is comparable to the blur you would get with a real-world camera when zooming in while recording with a long shutter. Actually this setting could well be used to create some sort of god ray effects like so. The center control allows you to control from which direction the blur should occur. The clipping mode works the same as in the blur tool and is covered in depth in the tutorial for the blur.